looking to stop that and huddled up for strategy for warmth. We're just saying hi. St. Henry Tri Village from Bath High School and Owen Layfeld runs a lot. You're going to see plenty of him here in the next minute or so. Up the middle for a first down, then Layfeld again, picking up some nice blocks and carried for 16 more yards. Then going to try the other side. Layfeld off tackle, drags defenders down inside the 10. A couple plays later, then Layfeld dragging all three villages into the end zone. St. Henry with the touchdown up fifth, 14 to nothing. Going to go for two. Their kicker injured a couple of weeks ago. So Layfeld puts it in the end zone again for two. It is 16 to nothing. Now Redskin defense doing work. Braden Keating flushed out of the pocket. Luke Gells getting in for the sack, forcing the three and out. Moving to the second quarter. Layfeld back to work. A mini hurdle. Apparently they don't throw the flag if the hurdle is less than two feet. He picks up 12 yards on that play there. Or maybe they just didn't see it. That's also possible. Bryce Brookhart now. He's going to give Layfeld a spell. Keeps it. Gets up the middle. And then a few plays later, James Lang on the jet sweep. Going to get in for the touchdown. But you see the flag come down at the very end. Holding. This one's called back, so no touchdown. So we go to fourth and goal. Brookhart looking to pass. And Keating right there for Tri-Village coming up with the interception. St. Henry would have two touchdowns wiped because of penalties in the first half, but ultimately it matters not. St. Henry advancing 34 to nothing. They get the shutout victory over Tri-Village. We'll update you on what the region looks like later on in the program.